Fathers, love everyone, and welcome to the Daily Devotional for September the 26th from Finders Keepers, Finders of Truth, Keepers of Faith. Today's quote, A true faith in Jesus Christ will not suffer us to be idle. No, it's an active, lively, restless principle. It fills the heart so that it cannot be easy till it is doing something for Jesus Christ. That's George Whitfield. Today's title, What the Spirit is Saying to the Churches. In Revelation chapter 2 and 3, Jesus gave some very important exhortations through the Spirit of God to the churches concerning what they should do, what to repent of, and what to expect and practice. It is time for churches to wake up, rise up, repent, and start being the overcomers, pillars and supports of the truth, the salt and light and temples of the living God that they are called to be. Twice the Spirit talks about those who claim to be Jews, true spiritual ones, but weren't, who loved doing deeds but had left their first love, who had a name that suggested life, yet were dead, who claimed to be wealthy and adorned, yet were spiritually bankrupt and naked. Thank the Lord that His will and desire is for those whom He loves, reproves, and disciplines to respond properly and become overcomers of all that seeks to overcome them, so they may become partakers of all that He has promised them. A short devotional today. I hope it blesses you. I'll throw the scriptures in here that go with today's devotional. Dust off your Bible, open it up, read them, meditate on them, let them sink into your heart, not just your head. Also, if you need a Bible, of course, send me an email. I'll be more than happy to mail a Bible out to you. Don't forget to pray for the children, our fellow brothers and sisters all around the world, and for those still lost in the darkness, playing church instead of being to church, so that they too can someday see the light. May our Father bless you. May He keep you. May His grace shine upon you and bring you peace. I'll see you next time.